Good boy. Okay. How did he activate the robot earlier? That robot was active for a second. What did it? I'm wondering. Alright, sorry little friend, but you're gonna have to die so I can get to the next little friend quicker. Okay. <gasps> little friend is trapped! He can't die if he's trapped! Yes! I've saved him. I might have killed him again. Crap. Volt walkers. Makes sense. Makes sense. Makes sense. No, no, friend! No! <laughs> oh. My poor volt walker friend. Okay. Alright. I think I see what's going on here. I jump off little friend and get up there, I'm guessing. Okay. Oh no, no little friend. Shoot, too late. Alright. Sorry. Sorry, buddy. Gotta get the next one. Sacrifice for the greater good. No, oh, that didn't work. Oh, little friend's going the wrong way. Save little friend. Yes! <laughs> I have saved Voltwalker. And jump for tomorrow. Jump for today. Huh. Do I not have enough juice yet? Hmm. If I just stand on him, he can't die. But I have to continue my quest. Uh oh. Well, that one's toast. Wow! This is a real puzzler. How about that for a puzzle game? It's puzzling. Who would have guessed? Hang on that. Am I just getting too much speed momentum to actually do it? Okay. Get up. Get up. No, 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 no. You stay. Go the other way. Uh, that's perfectly fine, man. I definitely appreciate the fact that you are not a backseat person. Because satisfaction in figuring out for yourself is wonderful. Alright, let's shove you down here. Because I feel like it. Do mm. I can trap you again? Perfect! You stay right there. I'll come back for you later. Maybe I can punch that thing. Oh. Did you run out of charge? Do Volt Chargers run out of charge? Is that a thing? 
course. Gotta use the fighting game philosophy. Maybe I can... Ah ha 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 Yes! Okay. Now, what purpose did that accomplish? What does that allow me to do? Uh-oh. Yeah, yeah. I think I'm getting the right idea. Oh, duh. Opposites attract. Magnetism. We could do it. Okay. Not quite. Okay, okay, I think, just need to execute this right, that's like, ah, shice, yeah, Oof. maybe after I pass it I can switch immediately and still stay hanging on the wall, that would be great, nope, that's not how we do it, okay. Yeah, it's definitely, again, yeah, got the idea. It's all about the execution at this point. Yeah. Okay. Oh no, no, I should have just quick dashed. <laughs> okay, we're going to do it. We're going to get this scroll. No! <laughs> okay, quick dash, then activate. Quick dash, then activate. Okay. Ooh, not fast enough. Remember that. Boom. Get on that. Okay. Now. A little bit, a little bit, a little bit, a little bit, a little bit. Quick dash. Yes! Lone ambition. Ah, the satisfaction of victory. Alright. Now where am I? Oh, wow. Some definitely side shoot. What? Oh, those are magma rocks. Okay, fair enough. They kill you. Makes sense. Makes sense. Oh, goodness. Oh, boy. <laughs> That's fair. Just have some bouncing magma rocks. Sure. Sure. It's all fair. Uh. So I gotta get one out of the way so I can ride that elevator. What can I do to these things? Anything? No, they just kill me. Can't punch them. I want to punch things! I want to solve all my problems through punching. Oh, that kind of worked. Sure! <laughs> Did it by accident, but I'll take it. <laughs> hey, I gotta tell you, Bully, this game's really, uh really liking it. Uh, except when I do that. Except when I do that, too. Okay. So we're gonna chill, and we're gonna ride. Chill and ride. Chill and ride. Okay. There we go. So the assembly machine do the work for me. I have to start all the way at the beginning, don't I? Yep. Okay. Scoot past one. There we go. We got this game on sale. I saw it was like a more puzzle-based Metroidvania type game. And I was like, yeah, sure. And Wow, really liking it. Very impressive. 
Oh, no! Okay, that part I should probably jump and uh, click dash. Oh! <laughs> Random magma block out of nowhere. Really? Well, Voli, I love. I was actually. I think you came in. I like that. Uh, that garden part before the crow boss. I like the difference in the um, kind of the atmosphere you set because you're in that like tree area and it's really nice. And then of course you uh, go back into the castle and then um, suddenly it's all like evil music and I just like the difference you have. Yeah, I like like the little atmosphere that I hear back. You can kind of hear like the metal hammers and stuff in the background. I'm not sure if that's you or the sound crew, but I'm looking forward to the sequel because this game's really, really fun so far, except when I die. Oh, sweet! Well, my compliments, Lavoli. Very nice job on the music in this game. You know, we're talking Metroidvanias. It's all about setting the atmosphere right. Don't necessarily need something super memorable melody-wise. You just need the right atmosphere for the job. And so far, everything I've heard does it very well. Okay, slug friends. Don't die, don't die, don't die. Oh, right. Where if I could just put a like ton of them up there? Not sure what it'll do, but Whoa. Yes. Yes. Everything does not need to have music. Just use music or lack thereof. Alright, let's head up. Let's see what these guys are doing. Some of them fell down. Whoa! Okay. Interesting. Oh no! Do I need more than one? Is that the solution? Uh, okay. Oh, wait. We can work with one. Oh, really? That hard, huh? Where you just not had the time. Oh, shoot, 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 shoot. Oh, thank you, Quick Dash, for saving my life. All right, let's go down then. And they're on the other side. Sweet. Cool. Oh, you end up rage quitting. Yeah, it definitely is a little rage inducing at times. <laughs> oh, jeez. <laughs> so, did the developers also have trouble with it? Oh, yeah. This this corridor looks awful. Something to watch when you work. Sweet. Good lord, speaking of rage inducing, this corridor looks like death. <laughs> okay, we made it, we made it, we made it. So, I, I'm kind of, you know, obviously with like Tesla grad and definitely getting kind of a Russian sort of feel to this game would I be correct in saying that and when you were working on the music did you kind of go for a more like rush use a little bit of Russian folk song or uh, am I completely off on what culture or anything this okay um, that wasn't the right idea it's 
It's kind of, you know, very sad and melancholy feel to it. Like, I can tell the story is probably really sad because it looks like there was a big war and we're suffering the effects of it. Okay, there we go. Woo! Dude, you gotta grab onto that ledge. 